a very warm welcome to you. Thank you for joining us in this tutorial where we are going to be learning how to withdraw money from Coin Market Cup. So to get to Coin Market App, you simply come to coinmarketapp.com and then you register. So here I'm already in my account. At the top right corner where we have our profile, this is where you can get your settings and then all the details about your profile. If you want to create a new profile, you simply click on your profile picture here, then click on profile and then you give your profile name. You can connect your wallet or you can add a transaction manually. I'm going to do that manually. I'll do that, then add the name here and then click on create profile and my profile has been added. Then I can now add a transaction or I can connect my wallet here. So let me add a transaction and then I select the coin that I want to trade in. I'll use Ethereum and then I can either decide which transaction I want to make. Is it to buy, to sell or to transfer? So in this case, I just want to, I'll click on buy. Then the quantity is here and the price per coin. So I'll just put 10 and then I'll add the transaction. I can also see the fees here. I can add the notes here. So I click on add transaction. It will recalculate and give me the current balances and all that. So you notice I have my details given here. For my profile, you notice we have different portfolios here. I have my, my main portfolio. I have the Njof and I have the Njoro. So you notice all of them have different details. Now, if I come at the top here for the cryptos, I'm able to access cryptocurrencies in terms of these groups, those that are ranking, the recently added, then I can also see the categories, spotlight, gainers and losers, and then I can see even the historical snapshots. I can also see NFTs in terms of all of them or the top collections or even upcoming sales. I can also view on-chain data, that is Dex pairs and chain ranking. Other things you can access at the top here are exchanges in terms of spot derivatives and DEX, the community, products, and then LAN on this side. At the top right corner here, this is where you have your main currency and you can change that if you click on that. You notice you can change that to Euro, to Pound Sterling, to Bitcoin, to Ethereum. So currently mine is set at United States and I'll leave it at that. And then you can change the language at the top here. Currently I'm using English, so I'll leave it at English. But you notice we have so many other languages here, which you can also set. Now, if I now come back to my cryptos, you notice here I can look at recently added, for instance, or I can look at ranking. So let me look at the ranking one. But also with the recently added, if I click on that, you will notice we have the new cryptocurrencies that were added. For instance, we have Waluta. Uh, current price it at zero point seven dollars. Then for then we have all these other details. And when you come to the end here, this one was added eight hours ago. And then we have the second one, Magic Shoes, which was added twenty two hours ago. So you notice we can access that in terms of cryptos that are recently added. We can also check that using the ranking ones. If I click on ranking. You now notice down here, I can get all the details about the ranking one. Currently, the Bitcoin is leading. And then we have Ethereum, Tether, USD, XRP, BNB, and all this. So this has already been ranked. And you can also see the categories, then the alleged sex securities, the oracles and the filters here. So if I want specific details, uh, let's say for Ethereum, for instance, I'll click on Ethereum. And you notice currently here it's at 1,874, which is an increase by 0.76%. Then I can view its details here. For instance, if you notice at the beginning here, it was high, then it had a drastic drop, and then it came to uh, almost half of what it was here at the top here. So I can see those details. I can also see the comments on this other side. You notice here we have these questions and uh, comments so I'm able to follow up on this so that I can get all the details that I need. And then I can also click on analytics at the top here so that I can get the Ethereum 
analytics are down here. You notice they are all added here. For me to withdraw any money that I would have here on coin market cap, which is a challenge to many, I simply go to another site called Pancake Swap. And once on the pancakeswap.finance, and I'll be leaving that link in the description of this video, this is the page that you'll see. We have trade here, then we have earn, we have win, NFT, and then we have game. Then on this upper right corner, you notice you can connect the wallet here. And at the top here, you can change the currency. You can select the network. You can select the network, either BNB Smart Chain, Ethereum, Polygon, or Lini Goretti, or any other, for instance, Aptos. So you can do that here. For us now to withdraw our money from this coin marketplace, especially maybe if you are transacting with Ethereum here, you simply come to pancakeswap.finance and then here for trade, you click on this side, you will come to trade here and then click on swap, on swap there. And then on this left right hand side, you can now change your, you can swap your tokens here, you can trade here, you can swap, swap your tokens here. For instance, I want to check on Ethereum. I'll click on that token. Then I click on connect wallet. So you click on that. And then here you can now paste the address. So you will come back to your coin market cap. And here we have our Ethereum. And then on the left hand side here, you will scroll until you get to contracts. And here we have contracts. So then you copy to clipboard the link for that contract here. So the link is copied. Then you go back to Pancake and paste the address there. And then you click on Manage Tokens. And then you click on Connect to Wallet. And you notice we have the options here now, the wallet that you want to connect to. If you have the Coinbase wallet, you have the MetaMask, whichever wallet you have, you click on that. If you have the Coinbase wallet, scan to connect with one or four mobile apps. That is if you have the Coinbase app, you connect to that and then you know how to withdraw now from Coinbase app. If you want to withdraw your money now from Trust Wallet, you click on that. If you want to withdraw that from Math Wallet, you simply do the same. You will simply be clicking on the app here that you want to withdraw your money from. And then you can now, and then you can now follow the requirements here. For instance, if I select the Coinbase, you notice it is not installed. But now I can connect with your self-custody wallet. I can also connect with Coinbase account here. And if you don't see the account that you want, down here you can see more. You click on more so that you can now see others here. For instance, you can see we have Coin9B, we have Ledger, where you can now connect that and withdraw your money from Coin Market Cap. And so that is simply how you withdraw your money. Remember, you have to use the Pancake Swap here. That is PancakeSwap.finance, and you'll be able now to withdraw your money. I hope this has been helpful. Kindly like this video, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel.